Welcome to another one of our Bluebeam Me Up How To Tutorials, brought to you by Brighter Graphics Limited, where we show you how to maximize the potential of your investment in Bluebeam Review. Brighter Graphics are the oldest established Bluebeam partner and your premium Bluebeam solutions provider. Let's get started. In this video we will teach you how to use the sketch tools in review to design quick, rough templates. If you create a lot of sketched or altered drawings, it is useful to have document templates ready to use so you can start in the best position. You can use the tools in review to create and share branded templates for company and project standardization. We will start off with a blank document. From the menu bar go to File. And click New PDF. The new document dialog will appear, prompting you to select the size, orientation, and style of the document. Set the document to landscape mode. Ignore the template options for now, as we are creating one. Set the style to grid. Light blue, 0.635 cm. Click OK, to create the document. Grids can help you more accurately snap lines to points, especially with snap to grid selected under the view menu. Before you do anything else, click on File, and then New PDF from Template, and select Save as Template. Let's call this sketch underscore template, for example. Once you've saved this to the templates folder, you will notice that there is a template icon next to the file's name in the document tab, indicating that you are in template edit mode. Should you have to come back later and edit it, you can go to File, New PDF from Template and hover your mouse over the sketch template we just created. Click the Edit Template icon that appears at the right, which will open the template in edit mode. Now we can go about customizing our template. You have options to create your own or you can copy your company's standard title block or document frame and edit it as needed. The shape and text markup tools can create an editing area and title block on the document from a blank page. Here you can see rectangle markups with a logo image added, as well as a couple of text boxes that you can use to add important information like project numbers, sheet numbers, responsible parties, and other things like that. You may want to keep an unflattened version of the document for edits later. With all of the template markups added, flatten the document to prevent changes. When you're satisfied, click Save, which will update the template. Once you have a template, from the menu bar go to File, New PDF from Template and select that template to use it on a new project. Thank you for watching. We hope you found the video useful. You can visit our website, www.brightergraphics.com, for more videos in the how-to series and all things Bluebeam Review. We at Brighter Graphics, welcome your feedback to help us to improve. 